Albuquerque native Andrea Howard made her Olympic debut this summer with the Italian softball team. She is a double major at UNM studying biology and psychology, and that's led her to an opportunity in COVID research. Brandon Ortega spoke with Howard about her passion for medicine. Andrea Howard loves playing for UNM softball. She loves learning about the medical field even more. Back in November, she got a chance to explore the fast-growing world of COVID-19 testing. I was in a research class, and my professor at the end of the semester was, was offering uh, student employee positions to my classmates and I. Um, so I decided to, to take him up on his offer. Just like that, Howard joined the staff at UNMH. We're testing new devices to, to make COVID testing more like accessible, I guess, to, to everyone um, and make it quicker for, for results. Working in COVID research comes with challenges and lots of responsibility. Howard says she's soaking in all the knowledge she can. The doctors in the emergency department are so open for questions and, you know, because, I mean, UNM is a, is a teaching hospital, so it's, it's awesome to be able to be in that environment. It's just been so much fun. I just, I really appreciate being able to talk to patients in the emergency department and, and you know, being able to work with them and, and learning kind of about their story. Howard's mom and dad are proud to see their daughter take on a job like that, especially during a pandemic. It takes a particular person to be a doctor, to be in this field, and I cannot stop her if this is what she really wants. You have to be really a different person that loves this work, that loves this life in science. Mr. Howard, what does that mean to you to watch her do that in, in the medical field and be so passionate uh, the way she is? Absolutely love it. So, I mean, she's often said that that softball work ethic, it really, it really became ingrained in her. She's told us, yeah, I mean, I bought into it and she does it in everything she does. One day we'll be calling her Dr. Howard. Until then, many years of studying are ahead. I know that I would love to go to medical school. Um, I'd love to be a doctor. I don't know what kind of doctor. Um, everywhere that I've looked, I've just, I've absolutely fallen in love with every specialty I've seen. But I think that gives me hope to, to be able to find something that I truly love in medicine.